Hey everyone, this video will be about what you should do to best prepare yourself for when the DLC arrives. However, before we jump into that, I want to remind you that Horizon Forbidden West hasn't had any official news at this point about a DLC or its release date. But we can safely assume it will be coming and using the timeline from the Zero Dawn to its DLC The Frozen Wilds, we can have an accurate guess on when we can expect it. So Horizon Zero Dawn was released back in February 28th, 2017 and there was an announcement for the DLC on the 13th of June in the same year and on the 7th of November 2017 the Frozen Wilds DLC was released. Due to Horizon Forbidden West also launching in February the 18th, it would be reasonable to expect a DLC around November this year as well. The only problem with this is it is now July and we haven't received any announcement for a DLC. So there may be delays due to the spin-off VR game also in development by Gorilla and Fire Sprite, which is Horizon Call of the Mountain, and delays due to COVID, which a lot of uh, game developers have experienced. All that aside, let's jump into the best ways for you to prepare for the DLC. Firstly, majority of people would have already done this by now, but making sure you fully upgrade an outfit that best suits your playstyle, a weapon with high elemental damage to get machines into elemental states quicker, and your favourite weapon for dealing high damage. This isn't to ensure you're as strong as possible as the DLC will most likely increase difficulty of machines and introduce newer and tougher machines like what happened in the Frozen Wilds DLC. Secondly, the Frozen Wilds DLC introduced a new branch to the skill tree, so if this is repeated then ensure you have unlocked all the available skills before the DLC is released. That way you can focus on the new skills straight away and without wasting any of your time. The last thing is you can almost guarantee there will be new gear to unlock such as weapons, outfits and coils. So as was the case before starting New Game Plus, it would benefit you to farm resources now such as tough machine parts and metal shards. This will help you to afford the new gear quicker and upgrade them sooner as there will most likely be a grind to upgrading everything like there was in New Game Plus. Make sure you subscribe so you can keep up to date and get any new official news about the upcoming DLC.